We gonna figure out who the mole is. Talking to the homie. When I find out who's giving shit out, oh, that nigga's gonna get more than a wedgie, nigga. Yeah, once again, they don't let the GDs in the dough. You know what I mean? And Queens is definitely in the building. And it's party time. Let's go. Hey man, real say say shit. You already know what the fuck going on. We posted here today. What's good? We got Rami in the building right now. He's posted. He's about to tell y'all some exclusive information that he just found out. So we just, uh, I mean, I literally just got this information. This shit like, crazy. Yeah. Uh, well, first let's break down the whole situation. So Consequence just posted a video on Instagram. I know you saw it. He had the Halloween vampire teeth on. Yeah. <laughs> Looking the, like fucking handsome Squidward and shit. <laughs> the, he, had, uh, he had chiclets gum and he, he had <laughs> individually into his mouth. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> I'm gonna play that shit. I'm gonna play the video. Yes. Him talking and shit in the, in the video. And he was talking about the mole that leaked Kanye West this track to Drake, for Drake to drop it on his OVO sound radio or whatever. And he was talking about looking for the mole. So we have a couple sources near their camps, and I got a, I got a source, you know, who contacts me and tells me a very obvious story about who the mole actually is. So if y'all want to know who the mole is, keep watching. So I'm gonna break this down to y'all like this. For sure. In Chicago, you you heard of BDs and GDs, right? Yeah. So you know the BDs, black disciples, right? Don't get along with the GDs, gangster disciples. You feel me? So it's BDs, which is the trade. One, two, three. That's a trade. Trade three, deuce two. Understand me? And the GDs, which is the forks. That's the mod. That's the I, I like Maseratis because they got G's on it. You feel? It's the pitchforks. <laughs> it's the Poseidon's trident. You feel? So they don't get along, and we're kidding right now, but it's like serious, like. E Day 600 just got murdered. You feel? Basically, GDs and BDs. Yeah. So, which, which one do you claim? Me? I mean, I would claim neither, probably, but I know that in the music. You, you know which one you'll claim, right? Come on. <laughs> I mean, I would probably claim BDs if that were, if that were the case. Well, are you claiming BD? I mean, I guess. I mean, I don't, I'm not really from Chicago or some shit, so I, I can't really say. But those niggas be in the industry for real. Yes, yes. And, and Ruga talked about that. He said, the BD said, I can't get on the song with you. And he said something like, fuck is wrong with dude after that. <laughs> Anyways. Who, who would you play? Huh? Who would you play? I can't claim no game, bro. I'm not affiliated with him. I got homies at GD, though. That they said they said I'm cool to throw up the forks. The fork? Yeah. They throw the up a fork, fork, a pitch fork? Yeah, but I don't, I'm not a GD or a BD. I don't believe in gangbanging. I believe Facts. we should either be cops or politicians. No cap. The cops could kill their ops and get away with it. The police, it. man. Shout out to the cops. Shout out to the police. We snitching all day. Yes, sir. <laughs> Snitch, Snitch gang. gang. <laughs> <laughs> so, so what were you saying though? So, with the BDs and GDs beef, Dirk is taking this shit very seriously. You yeah. notice I said the name Lil Dirk, pay close attention. Now, on this track, Kanye says on GD. Keep in mind, Dirk's brother just died. Like Dirk lost Bond, Dirk lost Nooski, Dirk lost Chino. These are a lot of people that was That's very, very, yeah, bro, very, very close to Dirk too. Like his man, one, one was his manager, one was literally his brother and manager. So he just lost his older brother. His older brother died, like, like literally died and got killed. And I don't want to say who did it, but. A lot of a lot of my sources again off Reddit. You feel that's where that's where all the, the gang members go to talk yeah. about the bodies that they caught and stuff. Bro. They off Reddit. They told me like it was GDs that did that shit. So it's like Kanye claiming GD now. What what would you do if you're Lil Durk and you're cool with Drake and you're calling him the decade? Leak that shit, bro. You feel it? And that's leak that shit. Leak that shit. And that's what I think Lil Durk did. I think Durk yeah. leaked the track. And no, we, we, we gotta cut out the part where I say I think. And that's that's exactly <laughs> that's exactly what Dirk did. He Dirk, licked the track, yo. He licked the track. That, that's what the source is saying. I mean, what reason do they have to lie? What reason do we have to lie? Uh, and again, I can't confirm 100 percent that this is fact. But if the dude next to Dirk, if the dude behind Dirk at his show is telling us this, you know, I mean, no, come cap. on, man. You so, already know. So that that's that's the little war games that's behind this and being played and. Uh, when he claims GD, he, I guess he didn't think about like, Dirk in that moment. Yeah, man. And now he's about to just drop his, uh, I think he's about to drop the official song tonight, right? Yeah. Yeah, the Andre 3000. I doubt Andre 3000 knew he was going to be in this gang war either. 
Yeah, and I think Andre, uh, he's just like real, real, real soft for not picking sides. Uh, <laughs> you know, like, he just sitting on the fence trying to play both sides. Nigga, we ain't fucking with that shit. You feel me? Yeah. Pick up a gun and <laughs> You dig? For real though. Pick a side. Pick up a gun. You feel me? Like, <laughs> can't be hanging with both niggas. That's that's how the Dirk situation happened with Dirk. You know, yeah. Look at this info. Who knows what other info Dirk no, can have? Yeah. Dirk can have a bomb in Kanye's car right now, and he, he would never even know. And he said that he would have blown him up just because he said we didn't want the GDs. You feel he? That shit crazy. He can call Kanye on Facetime right now. Like, hey, Kanye, hey, what's that GD shit you was talking about? Beat blow that nigga shit. So niggas gotta stop playing both sides. But really, in general, I think niggas need to stop beefing. Drake and Kanye have no reason to beef. They both no rich. Cap. They both multi, multi, multi billionaires. For real. Why, why are they beefing? Why are they doing this to each other? For why real, they... there's no point to any of this shit. Exactly. It's just going on. It's like it's black men destroying black men just for the sake of fucking white women. Exactly. For it's crazy for a white woman. White, white women cause this. White women, get in the comments and explain yourselves. For real. For what you what you've done. Drop a situation. comment in this shit and be like, yo, 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 yo. We as white women feel this way about Drake or some shit. Yeah, because we, we need to know. We need to know what y'all doing causing all this real. stress and trifle. Yeah, man. Stop tanning. Real say say shit. Stop fucking tanning. <laughs> Stay your natural skin color. You already know what the fuck is going on. Y'all think Dirk did that shit? You think fucking Logic did that shit? Who the fuck you think leaked that shit? Real say say shit. Like, comment, subscribe, we out.